What's good guys, it's Razzy Unique today, man. In this banger video, man, I'm gonna be bringing you guys the five-way menace build on NBA 2K24. So if you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like, subscribe, and turn on notifications, man. I hope this video helps you guys out a lot. But I'm gonna stop yapping, bro. Let's get into the video. Okay, guys, so first game on this build. This dude took a contested shot already off the jump, man. And you know what I'm saying? I had to go crazy, bro. I had to go crazy. And as you can see, man, he just didn't know what to do, bro. Like, I was just... He was way too little, bro. Like, I was there. Honestly, I don't even know how he got that contest, but I got it right back. And I'm taking that up for the easy layup, man. We always take our twos around here, you feel me? But yeah, um, I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in a while, bro. It's just been kind of crazy. Um, YouTube had demonetized my channel, so I kind of lost motivation for... You know what I'm saying? Recording and stuff. But we're back, man. And I almost got another steal right there, bro. I don't know what this dude was doing. He was just giving me steals back and forth. He ended up greening that shot, but it is what it is. So if you guys enjoyed this video, real quick, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you guys are new to the channel, man. I just want to say thank you guys for supporting me no matter what. Um, but yeah, so as you can see, he took an easy dunk. If I do sound weird, I am a little tiny bit sick or I feel a little sick. I ain't gonna lie, but it is what it is, bro. You know what I'm saying? We're still gonna upload every single day till the end of 2K24 and then going into 25, bro. I'm gonna try to upload at least a video every other day. But yeah, as you guys can see, man, we're going crazy already, bro. He's not guarding me, and I don't know why. So I'm just gonna shoot that, bro, and it's green. Like, what are you doing, my boy? Silver Limitless is literally so overpowered, and you get it on this build. And I don't know why, bro, but these people do not step up on me. I don't know why they just keep playing around. Obviously, that's green, and as you guys can see, this build is super consistent with shooting, bro. This build literally shoots so lights out, it's insane. This build can even fade, bro. It's crazy. Like, look at me going crazy, fading, going crazy, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie, most of the time when my percentage is low, it's because I was playing around and taking shots on purpose just to try to get, like, a funny clip or something. But as you guys can see right here, man, 83% for the three going crazy. He's not guarding me, and I don't know why, because I'm literally shooting very good, bro. I don't know why people do that, but, yeah, so I was basically just playing around right here, you know what I'm saying? And I try to shoot as much threes as I can, and as you guys can see, he's leaving me open almost every single time, and I don't know why. But this build... You guys are going to be surprised at the ball handle on this build, okay? You guys are going to be super surprised. I ain't going to lie, I did not mean to shoot that fade. I don't even know why it made me fade right there. I tried a quick stop, but I didn't end up getting a quick stop animation. So, it ended up making me fade. But it is what it is. And we're going to end up getting a steal right there, but we're not going to get it. So, we're just going to play some good defense. And I ain't going to lie, the sats don't show it that much. But this, this build is really good on defense, bro. I'm telling you, like, this is one of my favorite builds I've ever used in this game, bro. So, as you guys can see, that's the gameplay right there. We're going to get into the next gameplay, and then I'm going to get into how to actually make this build. All right, man. So, getting into game two. I don't know why, but for some reason, bro, these dudes just don't guard me. I don't get it, bro. Because them dudes will literally just drops to me the whole game, and I'm not dealing with that, bro. I'll take my easy wins in the theater, bro. You feel me? That's going to show you guys enough gameplay. It's going to show you guys that this build is still good no matter what. Because I ain't going to lie. These people that I play in the theater, they're, they're actually good. They just don't guard me, and I don't know why. They're like purples like 50 50 from the three bro like they're they're actually good at the game they just they just don't think i can shoot so they don't guard me for some reason i don't know why but i just want to show you guys the second gameplay because it's fast so you guys can see a little bit more about the build but this build is really good overall like for every single game mode i play this on every game mode bro and look at me shooting it right in his face bro i don't even know what this dude's doing like why aren't you guarding me if you know that i'm 100 percent from the three bro like i really don't know what this dude was doing i don't know what he was thinking but as you guys are going to see, bro, I'm just going to go crazy on him, man. I'm just going to go crazy. And as you guys can see, I shot that and I missed that. But like I said, man, most of the time when I'm shooting bad, it's because I'm taking or forcing shots just to get like a contested shot click, bro. These are just gameplays that I saved because I did really good in them. And basically, um, I'm just showing you guys how good this build is with these clips, all right? I have a ton of other games just like this, but I only really need to show you guys two. As you guys can see, he didn't recover enough, so obviously you guys know that that's green. But I don't know why these dudes don't be guarding me. I don't get it, bro. It's weird. Like, I really don't get it. And he's not guarding me again, so I'm just gonna shoot that, man. So let's get into this build tutorial, bro. All right, man. So in order to make this build, all right, make sure you guys copy these stats. And I'm gonna explain to you guys why these stats are the way they are, okay? So make sure you guys use Rebirth if you guys have it, obviously. It gives you silver badges right off the jump and a 90 overall to upgrade to. All right, so the position you guys are gonna wanna go point guard, obviously. Obviously, you're not gonna make a 6'6 build or a point guard without it being a point guard all right you're gonna want to make it 6'6 227 as the weight and 6'6 as the wingspan and i'm gonna explain to you guys why this build is actually the way it is okay 
So I did really go for a ones build, but I also use this on twos, threes, and fives. So to be honest with you, bro, it's very good overall. Okay, you get a 94 driving nook, a 94 three. Like the dribbling is still good. You guys can still get any dribble move in the game pretty much as a six six. Like the releases for jump shot are literally like outstanding, bro. So I'm gonna tell you guys right here, all right. The reason why I did drive a dunk is because I want to build that could dunk. You could dunk meter with this build. You have really, really good contact dunks on this build. And then you guys are going to want to make sure that you guys, you know what I'm saying, get a 7 4 driving layup. All right. This layup is still really, really good for the ones. It's really good on everything. Like, it's, I don't have a problem with it. I time my uh, layups really good still. And yeah, so you guys get gold posterizer, Hall of Fame slithery, which is very good. Precision dunker gold, aerial wizard gold. Bunny on Hall of Fame, which obviously you guys know Bunny is super overpowered, especially on Hall of Fame. Whistle on gold, which is really good for wreck spin cycle and two step and then for your uh shooting category okay i chose a 94 3 and a 79 mid range okay now you guys don't have to copy these exact stats you guys can go with a 93 but the reason why you guys want 94 is because you guys get um agent threes on gold if you guys go with a 94 and then you guys also get limitless on silver which you guys seen in the gameplays was doing very good for me and then dead eye on gold you guys get blinders on gold, catch and shoot on gold, green machine on gold. Like, it's just endless possibilities for this, you know what I'm saying, shooting category. And literally just the whole build is just endless opportunities, bro. Then you guys get a 79 mid-range, which is good enough to fade. I still could fade middies perfectly fine. And I could shoot lights out with this build. Like, it's literally overpowered, bro. I ain't gonna lie. And then your free throw is gonna be a 69. If you know how to dribble on this build and get open and create space, bro, you're literally gonna be chilling, all right? Now, I know the pack at pass accuracy is pretty low. But you guys can lower the driving dunk if you guys want to. That's all your personal preference to like a 90 or something. And then you guys can um put your pass accuracy up if you guys really want to. But I've been perfectly fine with it playing twos and threes. Um, honestly, I use this on a ones build too. But you guys can use this for twos and threes. I've done perfectly fine with a 55 pass accuracy, okay? Um, and then you guys also get an 85 ball handle. Which obviously, I want that to be better. But to be honest with you, Silver Speed Booster is still just as good. Like I really... I see a little bit of a difference, but you guys get every single drill move you guys need in order to get open and create space like this. This is a very good build, I promise you, bro. Silver handles for days, silver speed booster, silver unpluckable, gold ankle breaker, Hall of Fame physical handles, which is very good, bro. And then that gold ankle breaker is also very good as well. 75 speed with ball, obviously. Um, and then one really good thing about this build is this is the defense, bro. It's really good, and you don't have to waste a lot of attribute cap for this defensive build, all right? So... Interior defense is 74. That's going to be really good for playing ones and twos. Um, and then your steel is going to be an 85, so you guys get that silver glove. All right. That's kind of like the sweet spot if you guys don't want to go too high with your steel. It's 85. All right. Your block is going to be a 68, so you guys can get that chase down artist. And I've gotten a ton of blocks. I've gotten snatch blocks. Like, I've done really good on this build on defense, bro. My offensive rebound is a 60 because when I'm taking up them layups and throwing up them layups, bro, I want them rebounds. You feel me? And then defensive rebound, obviously, I just put it up just to get, like, a little bit better. Um, you know what I'm saying? I really don't have nothing else to put it on, so I just kept it on there, all right? Then speed is going to be an 81. That's just so you can get your speed booster on silver and hyperdrive. Um, Excel really doesn't matter that much. I've used different builds with different Excel, and it really hasn't changed anything. Um, my strength is going to be a 90. Now, the reason I chose that is because I wanted silver bulldozer and Hall of Fame physical handles as well as immovable forcer. And movable enforcer is so overpowered, bro. It reminds me of anchor. Like somebody can try to contact dunk on you, and you could just jump right before they're about to dunk, or like a little bit early, and you'll get them right out of their dunking animation, bro. And they won't be able to dunk on you. Like I've seen that happen plenty of times, and it's really, really good to have. And then your vertical is gonna be an 80. The reason I chose that is because you guys can get gold posterizer, gold aerial wizard, and then chase down artist, and then your stamina is obviously a 99. All right. I know I kind of got a little bit there. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. Alright, so now I'm going to show you guys what I really upgraded when I first started this build. So, obviously, I upgraded my 3 all the way. And I upgraded my driving dunk um, pretty much as much as I could. And ball handle was also something I upgraded right away and steal. Um, I haven't even upgraded my perimeter defense. And I play perfect defense. Perfectly fine. Like, I haven't even touched that. Um, For the most part, I've upgraded this. This is basically what I would upgrade. I'm only a 91 overall, so I only have a little bit of a difference. So, this is the what I would just upgrade right here. Okay, this is still, like, basically a fresh rebirth build. But I, I could be a 96, but I just haven't upgraded it. My pass accuracy is really low as well. Um, I haven't upgraded that at all. Um, just because I play 1s more than I would normally play 2s and 3s. Um, but this build is very good. This build is one of my favorite builds I've used in any 2K. Alright, so if you guys want a jump shot video, make sure you guys try to get this video to, um, let's say, 25 likes. And I'll drop a jump shot video, okay?
So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys drop a like. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel. Thank you guys so much for your recent support either way. Um, like I said, we're going to try to be way more consistent, bro. I just had a hot, like a ton of stuff going on, bro. Um, IRL and personally. Um, but we're going to try to drop as much videos as we can before NBA 2K25. And then going into NBA 2K25, bro, I'm going crazy, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make this a career path. I'm trying to make this something that I could actually do for a long time, bro. Hopefully forever, bro. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Enough talking, man. Thank you guys for your recent support, man. Make sure you guys comment W unique in the comment section if you guys got this far. But um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.